Hello everyone and welcome back to this podcast. In today's episode, we're going to be diving into chapter 8. And let me tell you, this one is a steamy one. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the hottest and wildest Yaoi podcast on the planet. Get ready to fan yourself because things are about to get steamy. That's right, it's time for Zeal Fujoshi, the show that's all about Yaoi manga. I am Cece, your host, the ultimate Fujoshi, who's always on the hunt for the hottest and juiciest and most thrilling Yaoi manga out there. I've read it all, and I'm not afraid to share my honest and unfiltered thoughts with you. From sweet and romantic love stories to spicy and steamy tales, I got you covered. My reviews are not only informative, but also hilarious. So you can expect to laugh your socks off while I spill the tea on your favorite yaoi manga. But before we start, this podcast is explicit. We'll be discussing mature themes, explicit themes, and all things that makes yaoi manga so delicious. So if you're not comfortable with that, it's probably best you tune out now. Let's get one thing clear though. Spoiler alert, I am not afraid to dish out spoilers. So if you haven't read the manga we're talking about, you might want to skip this episode. But if you're brave enough to join us, we promise to make it worth your while. If you're ready to join us on this spicy adventure, grab a cold drink and a cozy blanket and get ready to join me on this wild ride of passion, laughter, and all things yaoi. Welcome to Zealed Fujoshi. So we start off with Joe Jacob taking Kim Dan to the shower room, which is already exciting enough as it is. And then out of nowhere, Kim Dan accidentally defends himself and kind of punches Joe Jacob in the face. Can you imagine a physical therapist like hitting back on his VIP client? But don't worry, he quickly apologizes because, you know. Not only is Joe Jae Kyung his VIP client, Joe Jae Kyung can also easily knock him out because he is an MMA fighter. Let me just say, Joe Jae Kyung is being a good sport about being punched in the face. He didn't even mind. Uh, For him, it was just like getting tapped in the jaw um, and instead takes advantage of the situation of Dan being a little bit shaken about it and pins Dan down I mean can you blame him (laughs) things gets even more interesting when the cup when a couple of gym members walks in the shower room now most people will just be embarrassed and try to hide what's going on but no not Joe Jaekyung no he's so confident and secure with his status that he doesn't even care if other people sees them it was dan that was requesting that they hide it because he is the one who's embarrassed um but the best part for me in this chapter and also because of this gym members was when they started asking permission to use the shower you see we find out that joe jaekyung jaekyung is very particular about sharing the shower with anybody But the guys really needed to wash up after their intense workout. So Jae Kyung agrees to let them use the shower as long as they are quick about it. And even with all the people around, Jae Kyung and Kim Dan still find a way to keep their shower romance going. Being careful not to let anyone else catch on, I mean the chemistry between these two is off the charts. Um, All in all, chapter 8 is a wild ride of full unexpected moments and even more unexpected reactions and as always joe jaekyo and kim dan continue to keep us on the edge of our seats with their undeniable chemistry and passion tune in next time for another exciting episode of jinx attention to all yaoi manga lovers out there are you a talented individual with a passion for all things fujoshi If so, Zealed Fujoshi wants you. 
we're on the hunt for a team member to join our passionate and hilarious crew. If you have a knack for reviewing Yaoi Manga, a love for all things is spicy and steamy, and a desire to share your opinion with the world, then we want to hear from you. Join our team and help us spread the Fujoshi spirit to all corners of the world. Whether you're a writer, editor, or a social media guru, we want your talent and expertise to take Zilg Fujoshi to the next level. So, if you're ready to embark on this exciting journey with us, reach out to us in the description below and let's make magic happen. Join the Zilg Fujoshi team today. Let's show the world what the Fujoshi spirit is all about. And that's a wrap. Fellow Fujoshis and Fudanshis, we hope you enjoyed this week's episode of Zilg Fujoshi, where we dished out all the hottest and juiciest yaoi manga. Remember to follow me on social media where I share even more yaoi goodness and behind the scenes content. And if you're loving the manga I am reviewing, don't forget to support the author creator by purchasing their work and spreading the word to your fellow Fujoshis and Fudanshi friends. Thanks for tuning in Zilg Fujoshi and we'll catch you on the next episode. Until then, keep the Fujoshi spirit alive.